What's up guys, Collector Joey here, and today we have an amazing announcement to talk about, and that's going to be the Wolverine from Deadpool and Wolverine. This one is just one piece to the puzzle that I am waiting for. So sit back, relax, let's talk a little bit about it. We gotta turn the hot toys light on for this one, of course. But anyways, guys, tell me what you think about this figure down in the comment section below. Also, while you're down there, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Let's get to it. All right, everybody, so here it is right here. This is the collector edition, which isn't the, you know, crazy edition. We just got the collector's edition right here, which is starting at 280. And then, of course, we have the deluxe edition, which is at a staggering 340 $340. Sheesh, what a big upcharge for that. But is it worth it? Let's find out. So... What I see right here for the collector edition, we got my guy Wolverine right here looking absolutely beautiful. I mean, look at that, guys. Look at the mask. Uh, it, it looks great. It, it really does. And we do have some shoulder armor here. I know a lot of people were wondering uh, if we were going to even see shoulder armor on this Deadpool. And I think this kind of confirms that at least for now uh, that we will see that in the movie. Um, let's keep going. These just look so good. You get a regular base, of course, but it does have the cool uh, movie logo on it. And if I'm not mistaken, it looks like the slashes from the Wolverine, uh, I, it looks like it's indented in there. I don't know if I can uh, zoom in on this for right now, but it looks like the slashes are there. We'll look here in a minute, though. Maybe they have an up close uh, picture of it, but I'm barely seeing that if it, if that is anything, but here's just the clean version, which looks beautiful guys. It looks amazing. That yellow pops, that blue looks awesome, man. And then you got the interchangeable, uh, face plates where you got an angry one, uh, a regular express shirt. Well, not regular, but that's regular for, uh, Wolverine. Uh, and then we have, uh, just, you know, standing there. If I said, did I say Deadpool earlier this guy? I don't know. But here he is right here. Uh, man, that just looks awesome. I don't know if that base, I wish I could zoom in, but I, I kind of figured all this out with the new setup and everything. So I, I don't know how to zoom in. I don't want to try. Uh, but here it is. This is everything that you get with the collector edition of Wolverine. And we got the masked head with the interchangeable head faces, what we just said. Uh, deep, uh, it's a... It's an attachable claws so you can take them off or on which is pretty cool so you can have a fist or you know just the claws and then we have the base right here and some hands some relaxed hands that i'm pretty sure that you could take these claws off and put on the other ones why maybe i'm don't quote me on that maybe uh some more up closes of the the thing so that's 280 dollars worth um but let's go to the deluxe edition right here which I already have on pre-order, guys. I already pre-ordered this one. I had to do this review a little bit later in the day. But we have the deluxe version, which I love how they put it in yellow and red. That kind of matches his suit. Uh, with the sleeveless arms that we saw mainly in the trailer, this just looks amazing. Battle damage right there. And the battle damage gauntlets as well. Man, this is beautiful. And the seamless arms. So... Here's everything that you get with this one right here. So you, of course, get that Hugh Jackman head sculpt that looks amazing with the separate rolling eyeballs. And then you got interchangeable sleeved arms, which look even better. So that, that's why two getting two of these might be an option for you. I know it's an option for me. I've got one, and it would be the deluxe. But if the movie is really, really good and the sleeves and, and all that really matter that much, I think I might pick up a regular version of this guy to have like sleeve and battle damage and then one that's just all clean. You know, you could do so many things with this one. It's awesome. It's attachable claws like we get with everything. Basically, what you're getting with the deluxe version is going to be what I was saying earlier, uh, the rolling eyeballs and interchangeable uh, sleeved arms, interchangeable battle damage uh, armor as well. Um, the mat, we get the same one. Same thing from the other one. Uh, but man, this looks good, guys. I'm not going to lie. This is one of the best announcements that I have seen. It, it's just so nice. The Everything about it is on point. 
uh, the suit looks good. The head sculpt looks good. The claws look good. I wish they would be actual metal. I don't know if they are. They, they probably would have said die cast if it was. It, it doesn't look like it is. But they look good enough. He's 12 inches. pretty. He's 12 inches, so he's like the normal size of a figure. So that's good. Here's some more pictures of him. Uh, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen some of these already. Um, but, man, just awesome figure overall. Uh, announcement rating for this is a 10 out of 10 for me. Uh, I, I love this Wolverine. It looks so good in, in all the different ways that you can put him. Sleeveless with the mask off, sleeveless with the mask on, anything you want. Sleeves, all the full outfit you could put with this one too. Awesome freaking thing, guys. Man, oh, man, I can't wait to get this one. I've wanted to do this day one, but uh, but Pop Collectibles had it on pre-order. Uh, and they don't have parsley anymore. And I don't feel like paying interest on my payments if I go with PayPal. So I just got it from Sideshow. So if I do a little later review on this one, sorry guys, but uh, but I, I didn't want to. I did not want to pay that extra bit. So what I'm seeing what they're doing here is um, with these battle damage parts. So you could take the chest off right here. You could just take it off and then swap it out with this clean version, so you can kind of see the. Uh, the line goes right here, probably to around the traps. And then you can just take this full thing off. You probably have to take off the head sculpt, maybe. Um, but that's what it's going to look like afterwards. So that looks amazing. I'm not going to lie. I mean, the head sculpt, the texture, of course, whenever we do get the final product, it's not going to look this textured. We already know that. So that that's already a thing. But that's okay because uh, it's still going to look amazing, guys. It's still going to look awesome. I mean, look at that. How can you go wrong with that? Uh, but anyways, guys, what do I rate this? Oh, I said 10 already. Sorry, guys. I'm getting ahead of myself. Uh, but yeah, so tell me what you think about it, though, down there. I, I could be glazing this figure for all I know. But tell me what you think about it down there in the comment section below. While you're down there, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.